today's new rule. There will be no singing. That is my word, and that is the law. How am I gonna get down? Uh-oh, now it says there will be singing. Why are all these people singing? Didn't you show them my new rule? This is your new rule. Who did this? Yes, who did this? Next on Sogwa. What is that? Shoe? Rats? I can't stand rats. Get me my cats now. I want you to chase them out of the palace right now. Next on Sogwa, time for bed. Why do I have to go to bed now? You're still a kitten. But I want to stay up. Someday, someday soon. But Dongwa, you're too young to be out this late at night. That's what everyone says. It is true, you're not as little as you used to be. But you're still too young. There are just certain things in life, wonderful things, that come with growing up. Tomorrow, I'll show Baba that I'm grown up. Next on Sagwa. That must be Uncle Meow, Shigwa. It's a great honor to be here. <sighs> Don't you like history? I hate history. Help me, Sagwa Dongwa. Whoa! Whoa! The main thing is you're safe, Shigwa. We're all safe. We may not be. Look! <laughs> Next on Sagwa! They're acro cats! I'm going to be an acro cat someday. Someday, I'll even perform for the Emperor. I want to be an acro cat. No! I don't think you'll ever be able to do a somersault. Next on Sagwa. Oh, tongue. You sing with the voice of a thousand angels. What a treasure you are. I must end this once and for all. Next on Sagwa. It just seems like yesterday when I first found you in that pile of ashes. Help! Somebody help! What's that? Help! Please, sir, can you get me out of here? Whatever you say. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Don't call me sir. I'm not that old. Fufo's the name. You are... Sogwa. My name is Sogwa. Next on Sogwa. I promise I'll be back in time for dinner. All right, then. Uh, Good one, Sogwa. Uh, Sogwa, dinner. I better go. I'll see you tomorrow. Aren't you going to go home and eat, too? Well, my family doesn't have much food. Mmm. Is that your dinner? No, nope, that's your dinner. Where is everybody? Well, they were on time for dinner, so they've already finished eating. You eat what's left. Rice. That's it? Next on Sogwa! The burglar has stolen the jewel from the statue of your ancestor. <gasps> we must stop this Burglar! Hey, Fufu! Did you see anything suspicious last night? The jewel from the statue is missing. It's safe with some guy. That guy was a burglar. Oh no! A burglar! Next on Sagwa. Walk! Ah. I win! Oh, there you are! <laughs> I can win any time I want. Any time Sagwa does a race, you maybe. Nai-Nai always organizes one of her races. 
First place, here I come! First place, huh? Not if I can help it. Next on Long Sagwa. We have discovered how to weave a magical new cloth. Really? What's so magical about it? You see, the cloth is only invisible to someone who is foolish. Oh, well, um, it's very beautiful. But I saw nothing. But I saw nothing. Am I a fool? I'm afraid that I'm the one who's a fool. We must get to work. <laughs> Next on Sagwa. <laughs> Whoa! Sagwa, what have you got yourself into this time? <laughs> hey, nice haircut, Sagwa. I, I just escaped great danger. I'm lucky to have any fur left after what I've been through. You're coming with me. Next on Sagwa. Oh, I, your Majesty, I have just heard that a messenger from Beijing is on his way here with very important news. This one, I think. A message from Beijing, your Majesty. Well, what does it say? I've just been informed that I will no longer be village magistrate. Oh, dear. <gasps> Next on Sagwa. Did you hear about the really weird cats coming to town? Weird, weird cats? What do you mean? Well, first, they live in wagons, always traveling with these entertainers. And second, they're supposed to be real ugly, with big, strange ears. And third, they actually eat locusts. Ew, bugs? No way. <laughs> Tell me about it. Wouldn't want to have dinner at their place. Next on Sagwa. Can we go inside and watch them unwrap the presents? Well, we can, but don't you want to have the best view when the loveliest gift arrives? <laughs> no, a swan. So beautiful. Today is also your grandparents' anniversary. We have to do something special to honor their anniversary. Fufu, you can be our swan! Great! Wait, uh, what are you talking about? <laughs> Next on Sagwa. Rats! <laughs> Hundred-year-old fermented tofu for Yeye and Sagwa, too. What's the matter, young one? It's awful! Pee-you! But it tastes so good! I smell some hundred-year tofu! I want some now! But, your magistrate, there isn't any more. Well, then get some more! And get it quick! Next on Sagwa. My tooth hurts. Find the magistrate's daifu. I'm sorry, but the magistrate's doctor is visiting another village. I know of an old family remedy, but I am missing a quill from the crested porcupine. What's a crested porcupine? The crested porcupine is a very, very big creature, and it has huge, ugly teeth, and it eats little cats. <laughs> On Sagwa, play with the top. I'll show you. You coil your tail around the top of the top like this, and then pull. You haven't been paying attention. I know how to play, you know. You're so, you're so bossy. I'm going to run away. We'll find you. We know all your secret hiding spots. Not if I, if I, if I go outside. Where's Shigwa? <gasps> it's all my fault. Next on it Sagwa. Looks like an old treasure map. Yes, it's signed by Sun Yinsu, the poet. Reader, go fetch that English archaeologist who's working in the mountains. No! Oh! 
find this amazing treasure trove of poetry within several years. Several years? Next on Sagwa. Where are you off to in such a hurry? I have to practice my Tai Chi. Okay. Who's next? There they go again. Oh, good. You're here. It's almost lunchtime. We're having a very important meeting of the opera committee, so I'm going to be late for lunch. It's about being a family. And lately, we don't have any time to be a family. Remember the story about the mooncakes and the secret message? Don't you think Mama would love to get a message from us? Next on Sagwa. The legend of the Guai Miao, the ghost cat. The first sign is... When the shutters rattle. Oh. <gasps> Rattling shutters. The second sign of the Guai Miao is when its shadow drifts through the room. But the third and final sign <gasps> is when the lantern blows out. Next on Sagwa. Good morning, Wu Guai. Good morning, Wu Guai. Huh? What? Oh, good morning, Snail. <laughs> my, oh, my. What was good that? Good morning, Wugwei. Sagwa, you're a cat. You're spending so much time trying to be something you're not that you're missing the beauty of the garden. Oh. <sighs> Next on Sagwa. Who's that? It must be the Monkey King. Did I ever tell you I'm his biggest fan, my fantastically felicitous feline? I believe you might have mentioned it once or twice. Maybe Wu Shun will let me perform with him. All I have to do is practice and... Next on Sagwa. All right, my children. Now remember, the foolish magistrate is having a very important guest today. You must look your best and be on your very best behavior. And who's this important guest? One of the Emperor's cousins from Beijing. Did you notice them? Their beautiful silks and satins being carried around by servants on pillows like that? I'm Sagwa. I'm one of the foolish magistrates. We are in no mood for visitors. Just leave, huh? please. Next on Sagwa. I saw Pingwing first, you know. What difference does that make? She's going flying with me tomorrow. Pingwing's going to paint with me tomorrow. Flying! Painting! Hey there, Pingwing! Morning, Sagwa. Hey, do you want to go exploring today, Pingwing? Pingwing can't go with you. She's going to paint a picture with me. And everyone knows you can't paint, Foo Foo. That's it! Enough already! Next on Sagwa. Here, Princess Shigwa. They were bowing to her and calling her Princess Shigwa. Princess Shigwa? Let's go play. I'm sorry, Shigwa, but you're no longer just a simple kitten. And as a princess, you have a reputation to uphold. You have to be calm, <laughs> graceful, and wise. They sound like they're having fun. You must be missing your family. <laughs> Next on Sagwa. <laughs> <laughs> Sagwa! It's strictly against palace rules to play on the statues. Rules, rules, rules. Don't do this. Don't do that. Oh, and never ever jump onto the palace alley wall. You could fall and be swept away by the sea. Shigwa! <laughs> whoa, whoa! Shigwa! Next on Sagwa. Welcome to our beautiful village. Your Excellency, Your Grace, and the members of the court aim for this most beautiful of Chinese flowers, an exquisite diamond necklace from Roma. We too have gifts for you. Why don't you take one of our cats? I will take... I will take... Can Next I... on Sagwa. <laughs> Uh, actually, we can't let you in the club. You're too young. Sorry. Club rules. Let's do something better than playing. Let's start a club. 
Okay, right after lunch, we'll have the first meeting of the Explorers Club. And I bet we're way better explorers than you guys are anyway. Yeah, right. Look, we're ahead of them. <laughs> Next on Sagwa. I want to be a Gung Fu master. I'm going to see what was so special that Dongwa would miss such an important ritual. I am glad to have chosen you to be part of the Gong Fu demonstration. Don't worry, he'll be here. Rule number one. Where is he? Dong Guan knows how important this day is. He's been training for weeks. Oh no, I forgot that I had to write my first solo rule today. Next on Sogwa. Today is the day we are to pay our yearly visit to my dowager great aunt, Ta Yi Po. Be nice. And what your manners. Hello. What's that on your face? Ink. I don't play. I'm too beautiful to play. Anyway, only kittens play. Can I have some? Oh, where are my manners? Next on Sagwa. Because they are learning new skills. And at the end of the month, we shall have a banquet to celebrate your new talents. What are you learning to do? Make a fine pottery vase. Make delicious sweet balsa. Play a lovely tune on the people. Ah, that's it. I give up. I give up. No. I give up. Yes. I'm giving up. I give up. I give up. I give up. That's one song. Not here either. My cake necklace must be here somewhere. Wow! It's beautiful! Whee! I like this toy! Shigmok, your jade necklace belongs to Tai Tai! You have to return it! I found it! I keep it! <laughs> oh no! What do I do? Next on Sogwa! Today is the Dragon Boat Festival, and Boba's taking me to help catch fish for our feast! And you're not coming. Hmm. Sagwa, you can't go fishing today. I'm Baba's favorite. <laughs> Gongwa? <laughs> <laughs> Having fun without me. You know, son, I'm really glad I get to spend this time with you. Just the two of us. <laughs> it's true. Gongwa is his favorite. How about you, Shigwa? Oh, great. Sagwa, I'm stuck. And then I untie the ropes. We have to hurry. The balloon's going to take off. Oh, dear. No! I, I, <laughs> Next on, Sagwa. Dongwa forgot about me again. Maybe that's because he's hanging out with Hun Hun. I am so mad at him. What's the big deal? The big deal is... I saw her take a whole pile of shrimp from those baby <gasps> kittens in town. Hey, did you hear about Hun Hun? She's taking food out of little kids' <gasps> mouths. Did you hear about her? Oh my god. Sogwa! Hun Hun steals food. Uh oh. Next on Sogwa. Next on Sogwa. You did 12 of these wooden animals, Nai Nai? The 12 animals of the Zodiac. Sagwa and Fufu, you're one team. And Dongwa, you and Shigwa are the other. It's not fair. I can't find any hidden animals. I see it. The monkey's in this tree here. How you doing, kid? Who are you? Why, I'm the guy who's going to help you win your game. Next Remember, on Sagwa. Is taking you on an Imperial expedition. There's going to be a lot of work to do. When Uncle Meow puts me in charge, we'll be sure to find that old meteor in no time. I'm the oldest and most responsible. If anyone leads the expedition, it's going to be me. Well, he gave me the map, but he gave me the scroll. I want you to run messages between the diggers and the historian. Run messages? 